in the book of first john chapter 3 verse 18 first john chapter 3 verse 18 the bible says my little children let us not love in word neither in tongue but in deed and in truth my little children let us not love in word neither in tongue but in deed and in truth close your eyes take this prayer point loud and clear say oh god make a way for me where the enemy says there is no way in the name of jesus oh god make a way for me where the enemy says there is no way in the name of jesus oh god make a way for us where the enemy says there is no way for us in jesus name we pray amen today's topic is dream of someone confessing love to you dream of someone confessing love to you love is a very beautiful thing when you see someone confessing their love to you it shows that someone loves you so dearly and is trying to declare his interest for you when you dream of someone confessing their love to you it could be that someone has feelings for you or the dream could indicate your interest to enter into a new relationship with someone you may know the person or not but you feel this person asks what you are looking for maybe in the areas of beauty in the areas of money handsomeness like being a God-fearing person. For example, if you see a man confessing his love to you, he tells you such a man is in love with you and wishes to propose to you. He wants you to be the love of his life. But if someone you know tells you that they love you, it can mean that the man or woman has strong feelings for you or that you are having romantic feelings for someone who is confessing or proposing to you. But if you don't love the person, this is a bad signal that the person doesn't match your taste. But if you love the person, do not be afraid to express your emotion towards that person. Because it's possible that the person may not know that you have a strong feeling for him or her. When someone is confessing or her love to you in the dream, it shows that you are very valuable and important to that person. The person is trying to win your heart. Also, if someone is confessing love to you, it means you are thinking about your partner and you want to make that relationship a lot deeper. You are prepared to take a step further and revive your relationship. When someone is confessing his love to you because of sexual feelings in the dream, it means such a person is not truly in love with you, but to sleep with you and then break up with you and run. Be wise and be prayerful. On the other hand, on the other hand, dreams of having feeling for someone is a sign that you want to be in love, but unfortunately, you don't have that special person right now. Perhaps you are more careful in the type of relationship you enter with any person, or perhaps you are more careful with that person trying to come into your life. You wish to fall in love, but you have to be very, very careful of the bad events that happen in your previous relationship so that you not repeat itself in your present relationship. If someone you don't know confessing their love for you, it's a sign to be careful with people who suddenly have love for you. It's normal for strangers or men to have feelings for you as a woman, but you must find out if they are of a serious type or not. When your partner confessing their love to you in the dream or reality, it indicates the desire to hear your partner confessing their feelings for you. Perhaps you want to see his or her seriousness towards that uh, pronouncement or towards that uh, relationship. In conclusion, someone confessing love to you in the dream can be a positive and negative omen. On the negative side, it can be a warning of sexual trap, temptation, or satanic attempt to pollute you or defile you. May the Lord help you in Jesus' name. What that means is that it can deprive you of getting married on time to someone of your choice. Be prayerful. May God Almighty reveal secret things about that person to you. In Jesus' name. Instruction, if you are disturbed about this dream, go on two days fasting and prayers from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Say, every witchcraft plan and strategy to get me, scatter in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft plan and strategy to get me, scatter in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft plan and strategy to get me, scatter in Jesus' name. Spirit of sexual perversion, jump out of my life. In the name of Jesus, spirit of sexual perversion, jump out of my life. In the name of Jesus, spirit of sexual perversion, jump out of my life. In the name of Jesus, spirit of sexual perversion, jump out of my life in Jesus' name. So, O oh Lord, connect into the right person. In the name of Jesus, O oh Lord, connect into the right person. Connect into the right person. In the name of Jesus, O oh Lord my God, connect to the right person. In Jesus' name. Say, any person having a mission to pollute and defy me, be frustrated in the name of Jesus. Any person having missions to pollute and defy me, be frustrated in the name of Jesus. Any person having missions to pollute and defy me, be frustrated in the name of Jesus. Any person having missions to pollute and defy me, be frustrated in Jesus' name. Say, I break every covenant between me and the spirit spouse 
in the name of Jesus, by the blood of Jesus, I break every covenant between me and the spirit spouse. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If this broadcast has blessed you, share it to your friends and family. Once again, it's Evangelist Joshua from Lagos.